once again would like to welcome you aboard that blue flight. Thank you so much for service and watching the balance. My name is Karen, and it's my absolute pleasure to be flying with Lord. Our captain is Brian Dosen, and he'll be assisted by First Officer Chris Trump. Today's estimated flight time is an hour and 17 minutes. Thank you for flying with us today. safety is our top priority, so we appreciate a few minutes of your attention while we demonstrate the safety features of this aircraft. You can follow along with the safety information card in your seat back pocket. Federal aviation regulations require your compliance with all crew member instructions, lighted information signs, and posted placards. To fasten your seatbelt, insert the flat metal end into the buckle and pull on the strap to tighten. To release, just lift the top flap of the buckle. Please keep your seatbelt fastened low and tight across your lap, even when the seatbelt sign is off, and have your seatbelt visible to the crew at all times. Your life vest is in a pouch under your seat. If instructed by the crew, tear open the pouch, remove the vest, and pull it over your head. Wrap the strap around your waist, secure the buckle, and pull the strap to tighten. As you exit the aircraft, Inflate the vest by pulling down firmly on the red tab or blowing into the tube on both sides. A locator light on the shoulder will turn on automatically in water. Never inflate the vest inside the aircraft. This Embraer 190 has six emergency exits, two doors in the front, two window exits over the wings, and two doors in the back. Each door is equipped with an evacuation slide that inflates automatically when opened. Two life rafts are located in the front galley, and one is located in the left overhead bin on the right. All exits are clearly marked with a sign overhead. If necessary, floor-level lights will illuminate the aisle to help you find the exit. Please take a moment now to locate your closest exit, and remember it may be behind you. If there is a change in cabin pressure, three oxygen masks will drop from overhead. Remove the mask from the plastic retainer clip and pull it firmly toward you to start the flow of oxygen. Place the mask over your nose and mouth. Pull the elastic band around your head and tighten using the strap on both sides. Even though the bag may not inflate, oxygen will be flowing. Be sure to put your mask on first before helping others. We'll let you know when it's no longer needed. We will be passing through the cabin to make sure we are ready for departure. You can help us by making sure your seatbelt is fastened, seat back and tray table are sewed, and all carry-on items are put away. If you have any questions about the safety features of this aircraft, please don't hesitate to ask. Smoking, including the use of electronic cigarettes, is never allowed on any JetBlue flight. Tampering with, disabling, or destroying smoke detectors in aircraft bedrooms is a federal offense and could result in a fine. For your convenience, this aircraft has two restrooms, one in the front of the cabin and one in the back. Each is equipped with an infant changing table. We'll be adjusting the main cabin lights for departure. If you need it, there is a reading light above your seat. We're here to make sure you have a safe and comfortable flight. Thanks for your attention. We hope you enjoy the JetBlue experience. <laughs>